former first son in law Arab Kushner received a $2 billion investment from Saudi Arabia's Sovereign Wealth Fund, with expected annual management fees of $25 million, according to a new report, drawing comparison to first son Hunter Biden's overseas business ventures. Kushner's firm Affinity Partners made the deal shortly after President Donald Trump left office, despite the Saudi Public Investment Fund review panel's concerns about inexperience and a due diligence review that was unsatisfactory in all aspects, according to minutes of a June meeting reported by The New York Times. Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman leads the fund's board, which overruled the skeptics. A letter written by fund staff to a board member who dissented cited aims to form a strategic relationship with the Affinity Partners Fund and its founder, Gerald Kushner in going ahead with the deal, according to the report. Kushner worked as a top Trump White House aide and built a relationship with the Crown Prince while in office, including while working on the Abraham Accords that led to four Arab states establishing diplomatic relations with Israel. Trump is openly teasing a possible 2024 bid and Kushner's arrangement sparked it thick concerns from some of the same experts who slammed Hunter Biden's overseas ventures. Walter Schaub, director of the U.S. Office of Government Ethics during the Obama administration, tweeted that he was concerned about the possibility that Kushner may have influenced U.S. policy during his time in office to benefit potential future business plans. Makes you wonder if Tara did something with his official authority. For MBs before leaving government to earn that investment, Shaw tweeted, 